And ladies and gentlemen, the chair of the President of the United States of America. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. Last night, Mr. Clint Eastwood, famous director and star of such films as Space Cowboys and Every Which Way But Lose, mocked my record at the Republican National Convention. So I'd like to take this moment to address some of uh, Clint's comments. Now, first of all, my record for offering excellent lumbar support is beyond reproach. You can't argue that. Additionally, my microphone was not on at the time of the convention, so a lot of folks misinterpreted what I was saying to Clint. I'd like to cut live to a feed where my audio actually works so you can hear what I was saying. So, Mr. President, how do you, uh, how do you handle... Uh, how do you handle promises that you've made when you were running for election? And how do you handle, uh, how do you handle it? I mean, what do you say to people? Do you, uh, do you just, uh, you know, I know people, uh, people were wondering. Uh, I don't have confidence that you can handle asking this question. <laughs> you don't, you don't have it, okay. What did people say when you told them you were going to talk to an empty chair? You're, you're absolutely crazy. You're getting as bad as Biden. Hey, Clint, you should tell Romney to watch your film, J. Edgar. I can't tell him to do that. I can't do that to himself. Mm, I know, that's got off. Yeah. Yeah. You should find a way to make a storied 60 year career in film and television one big national joke. I'm sorry. I can't do that to myself either. So. Yeah. Let him go. As you can see, America needs a chair you can trust. I'm Barack Obama chair, and I Obamacare about the United States of America. 